Hello everyone. For this video, I'm going to be talking about the size factor. Uh, so, 4.3.6 size factor CF. Uh, the reference bending, tension, and compression parallel to grain design values for visual graded dimension lumber 2 inches to 4 inches thick shall be multiplied by the size factor specified in tables 4A and 4B. And the side factor accounts for the effect of the structural member size on the strength of the wood member. Um, and the depth of the wood member increases as the depth of the wood member increases, the deviation of stress distribution from the assumed linear stress distribution becomes more pronounced, leading to some reduction in strength of the wood member. Um, if you look, we have a table. And I believe this is table 4A. We have here uh, the grades, uh, select structure all the way to number 3. We have the depth of the water member, so it goes from 2 inches all the way to 14 inches. We have here the thickness of the water member. We have 2, we have 4 inches. So just for some examples, uh, here I have some typical water members. And I'm just going to quickly show you how to use it. It's very simple. So, uh, let's say for a 2x4, two by, two by the depth of the 2x4 is the 4. So, we go to here, we go to 4. And then the thickness is 2 inches. So, we have a 1.5 factor we're going to use for CF. Let's say we have 2x8s. Our depth is 8 inches. And again, our thickness is 2 inches right here. So then our CS factor will be 1.2. Okay, now there's another part, and I'm going to read it. It says here, uh, where the depth of the rectangular saw lumber mem bending member 5 inches or thicker exceeds 12 inches, the reference bending design values FB in table 4D shall be multiplied by the following size factor. Um, so we have right here this equation, CF equals to 12 divided by D to the 1 ninth. And it has to equal to, it has to be equal to or less than 1. So let's say we have uh, a water member here. Let me say this is 6. Let's say this is 20 inches. So then our depth is 20 inches. So our CF will be 12 divided by D, which is 20, to the 1 9. And if you plug that in your calculator, then you will get a result and I'm not sure what that is but it's kind of doing this on the fly but if I take out my calculator 12 divided by 20 it's 0 0.6 0 0.6 to the 1 ninth it's going to give me 0 0.94 approximately 0 0.94 so this will be my size factor. So as you increase the depth, you're going to lose some, some strength in the wood. Any uh, concerns or questions, just leave a com comment below and I'll do my best to answer back. Thank you everyone and have a great day. Bye-bye.